You wanna see some crazy and all so lazy? So you should meet me and my friends. Even though we got no money, for sure it's all funny. Yeah, everything's better with them. We're just like ooh ooh ooh. We don't worry about tomorrow. We just ooh ooh ooh. What we wanna do tonight? So don't tell me, tell me how it should be. How it should. All we want is to be. Samaria. Um, anybody else? Nobody? Why not? I guess they just want me to be their president. Okay. Well, I want to do a brainstorming exercise. Harper, can you come up here and help me, please? Okay, so I want you guys to think about some changes that you want to see happen at Austin High. So just shoot out your ideas and then Harper's going to write them on the board. Like anything? Yeah, anything. Since I'm new here, I'm not really sure. I can start. I think that students should be allowed to use their phones in class. Uh, I don't think we should have homework on game nights. Okay, anything else? What about Giving Tuesday? Oh, I like that idea. Like, every Tuesday the school does something to give back. Maybe have a soup kitchen for the homeless or write cards to soldiers. That's not what she means, Maxwell. The student council, especially the president, is supposed to use their ideas to help the students here at Austin High. Well, no, not exactly. Wait a minute, Aria. You think it's only about helping the students? What about helping the environment? We need compost bins and making sure everyone's recycling. And I'd love to see a garden at the school. Exactly. Think about more than just the students at Austin High, Aria. A leader can make all kinds of changes. Do you even know about giving back, Aria? Sure I do. Like what? My daddy did a fundraiser at the local animal shelter. And I helped them. Yeah, that's because your daddy sits on the board. Shut up, Violet. Hey, we do not talk to each other that way in this class. You know what? I'm going to change this around. Everybody get out a piece of paper and a pen. Harper, thank you for your help. You can sit down. Thank you. I want you guys all to write a paragraph as if you are running for class president. Why? No one's running for president except for me. Because this is an English class, Arya. I want you to do a writing assignment. Plus, this topic is relevant and it's appropriate. But Arya is right. If we aren't running for president, why do we need to do this? It seems like a waste of time. I just, I want you guys to think about what's important to you, okay? All I'm asking for is just one paragraph. Think about if you could really make a difference, what it would be. So, I want you to start your paragraph off with, my name is, I'm running for a class president of Austin High. I would make a great president because I want to make a difference. This is how I would do it. Okay, so you guys got about 15 minutes and this will be counted as a great, so go ahead and get started. This is so stupid. Yeah, I feel like you guys are. This is an individual assignment, guys, so please, no talking. No, I just wanna say Time's up, pins down. I can't wait to hear your ideas. So who wants to go first? Anyone besides Aria. Aria must give someone else a chance, please. Oh, Riley, go. My name is Riley, and I would make a good president because I'm new here to Austin High, which means I have new ideas. 
I would focus on healthier lunch and snack options for the students. The food here is pretty nasty. What's wrong with the food here? I like it. Are you an athlete, Jacob? No. Then you would get it. <laughs> Ouch. <laughs> Thank you, Rodney. How about you, Noah? Me? Yes, what did you write? Oh, uh, I wrote, I would be a good president because I would make it so we don't have homework. I, I totally agree. Okay, did you write anything else? No. Willow! Hi, I'm Willow. I think I would make a great president because I listen. I think we could do a better job at Austin High as far as helping our environment. We could have compost bins and, and a garden. We could grow vegetables and kind of like what Riley was saying, just healthier food here. We had a garden at my old school. It was awesome. And straws, what if we got rid of all the plastic ones and everyone brought their own? But isn't that like going a bit overboard? No, actually, I love that idea. Let's make Austin High a little bit more environmentally friendly. Exactly. Miss Jones, can I go now? I think everyone's getting a little off track. What do you mean? Well, hi, I'm Aria. I think I make a good president because I'll make things better for our freshman class. I will push for off-campus lunches. It's not fair that only seniors get to leave. We don't even drive yet. Anyways, I will also work on getting Fridays off. We don't need to go to school for five days straight. It's exhausting. Finally, we're thinking on the same page. How do you propose to make that happen, Aria? Well, like you all know, my daddy is the mayor, so I can talk to him and explain why we need some more breaks in our lives. Anything else? Uh, we need a swimming pool here at Austin High. I would set up a fundraiser right away so we can use it for all four years. I will work hard to make sure that my ideas happen, so please vote for me for your next president. Aria, we're not giving speeches. This is just a writing assignment. Oh, well, since I'm the only one actually running, I, I thought I'd add in that last part. Okay. Uh, Violet, do you want to share yours? I'd rather not. Okay, anyone else? Maxwell, do you want to go? Uh, sure. Uh, can I go up to the front for mine? Yeah, absolutely. I'd love to. Hold up. Okay, guys. So I want y'all to snap your fingers to make a beat like this. Hi, guys. You all call me Maxwell. I'm running for president here. You know if I win this, I will make a difference. I'll better the school in a year, yeah. Ideas come true and I promise the all to the tippity top of the tier. You all will adhere to the new pioneer. Take the reins just like I am Paul Revere, yeah. Helpful is fortunate, soup for the poor. Now they can go by the food at the store. We donate our clothes that we barely wore. Kindness is needed in their world, I'm sure. I hope that you like this, I made it for fun. I'm not in the athletics, but math I will run. If you listen right now, then I thank you a ton. I still got more ideas, but this stuff is done, yeah. <laughs> And I love what you said about using your platform to make a change. Do you ever think of running for president? Wait, wait, you, you can't tell him to run. I'm running. Well, I'm just saying, that was so good. And I only asked him if he was thinking of running. Well, I mean, I hadn't really thought about it. But should I? Yes! yes. Well, I guess I'll run. Yes! <laughs> oh my god. This cannot be happening. OK, you guys should all think about it. All you need is a few good ideas, a little bit of confidence, a little bit of eagerness, a little bit of empathy and charisma. No homework tonight. Yeah. Dude, president, that's crazy. So, do you think I should run? I mean, I haven't even thought about it before. Dude, you should definitely go for it, 100%. Okay. Hey, you wanna go home and play Fortnite after school? Definitely. Okay. fast as I could. What's wrong? Maxwell is running for president. That's what's wrong. But how? I thought you were the only one running. It's all Mrs. Jones' fault. Mrs. Jones? What does she have to do with this? Brooke, are you even listening? Miss Jones convinced Maxwell to run for president. Wow, okay, so now. We need a plan. We need to make sure that people vote for me and not for him. Any ideas? This is why I text you, I need some ideas. 
Um, what about making a bunch of cupcakes? People love cupcakes. And you put a little egg on top of them. I think I need something bigger than cupcakes. What else do people like? People love parties. <laughs> Can you throw a party? Oh, Brooke, you're a genius. That's what I'll do. I'll throw a pool party in my house. People will love that. Yay! Uh, okay. Um, after school, I'll come over and we can start planning. Okay, awesome. Okay. <laughs> thank you, thank you so much. I'll see you later. Bye. <sighs>